Hello and welcome. My name's Chuck. I'm Old Man Tarot. I do daily tarot readings. Every day we ask the cards, what are our opportunities for today? Oops. This is a reading for Thursday, August 11th. Thursday, August 11th. What are our opportunities for today? I do daily readings. If you like these readings, please do like, subscribe, and follow. That way you won't miss any of these exciting daily readings. All right, let's see what the cards have to say. For Thursday, August 11th. Thursday, August 11th. First card for today. The Magician. We're feeling very much in control today. We have control of our thoughts. Anything we concentrate on very hard seems to just manifest into our lives. No matter what part of the tarot it is. It could be money. It could be truth. It could be love. Just make sure we're concentrating on positive thoughts and positive energies. Uh, the more we do that, the more we focus, the more these positive things are going to come into our life on Thursday. Next card is the death card. The death card is uh, here to take something away, something that's been in your life a long time, just run its natural course, and something that's not needed by you anymore. Um, it's, uh, so it's time to let it go. Let death have it. He'll take it away. Uh, you're going to be better off for it. You've, uh, it's, you've run this course with you. You've used it up as much as you can. Uh, you used all the benefit you can, and now it's time to let it go. Uh, Four of Swords is the next card. Midway through the day, you may feel like you need a nap. Uh, you may feel like you need to rest and recuperate. Um, this is just a short break uh, that you need to take, um, and you'll feel better afterwards. Uh, you may also be going over to help uh, help a friend out that's not feeling good and may need to bring them some medicine. But this is just a card of a short delay or a short rest. Third card for the day is the Seven of Pentacles. Sevens uh, indicate that you're able to harvest uh, some of your, uh, your bounty right now, but you're also planning for the future. You're planning your future harvest. Do you want to keep planting the same thing? Do you want to plant it in the same way? It looks like you already planted some seeds. Something's growing into the future. But uh, Seven of Pentacles uh, indicates you may want to change some things. You may want to improve some, some things um, as to, to improve your future harvests. Last card for the day is the Page of Rods. He's bringing you a new message. This message stirs your passions, something you're thinking about in the future. You're kind of blocked for that, uh, that future right now, but you're thinking about it. You're focused on it. If you have that magician's energy and you're focusing on uh, focusing all your positive energy on the future, this wall is just going to disappear and you're going to be able to get to whatever you want to get to. Uh, so early in the day, uh, you do have a lot of uh, magician energy. You're able to focus on things. If you're trying to get rid of something, get rid of some old bad habits, just focus on the good stuff in your life. Those bad habits are just going to disappear because you don't, they're not serving you anymore. Uh, death's going to take them and they're just going to disappear. Midway through the day, you may need to take a little nap or take a little break or you may get delayed with something. Uh, later in the day, you are able to harvest some of your, uh, your bounty. Some of your hard work's come into fruit. Um, you're thinking about how to you can improve this. Maybe you get a double, you know, uh, get a better harvest into the future by improving your methods. Late in the day, you're going to get a message that it kind of stirs your passions about the future. You're thinking about ways you can get to the future, uh, but you're blocked uh, at least for a little bit right now. My name is Chuck. I'm Old Man Tarot. Thank you for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.